I'm Kate Tempest. I'm a writer and a performer and a poet um, and also the guest director of this year's Brighton Festival. Something that irks me no end is this like fear that seems to exist about people, you know, other people that don't come to the theatre, how do we reach them? There's this, this weird like snobbishness that exists around the arts. I had lots of hopes for it, but one of my big hopes was that we could do what we're doing today. Just bring the festival out a little bit, open it up. It's going to be a real success, I can feel it, in terms of community and the kind of impact. And I hope that people will get excited about performing here. Place is two weekends of activities in Hankleton and in Whitehawk in East Brighton. It's a range of shows and workshops for children, for young people, for adults and older people. We hope there's something for everyone. Kate Tempest's philosophy about the arts being social and not elitist really chimes with us at Brighton People's Theatre. It was really Kate's uh, energy and belief in the arts being out in communities which has enabled us to do this over these two weekends. I used to come here to rap, so I first started rapping here. I, I just loved music and I wanted to be a rapper. And when I heard that they did a, a rap course, I thought, yeah, youth centre, I'm going to there. So yeah, I, I'm still in touch with a couple, like the guy who taught me how to rap was called Max. And um, what he used to do to me, I'm doing to other people now. Here I'll be running a workshop tomorrow. I sp just preach the gospel of photography. And in that gospel, you are a photographer and you have the technology to simply record, see what things look like recorded and print it. That's all I ask of anyone, just, just shoot and ask questions later. Kate to me is like a Joan of Arc character. You know, if she wants to go to war, I will follow her. It's as simple as that. On a practical level, people are invited to come down. They're asked three questions that we've tried to simplify some deep artistic debate into yes, no answers. And then they get to throw the stones, cast the stones onto the beach, which we've painted white as a canvas. So each of their colors represents their answer. The final piece acts as this abstract representation of a debate. Storytelling Army are a group of people from all walks of life who will be popping up all over Brighton to share their own everyday epics. It's vital Brighton Festival is doing work like this and taking work out into communities. It's a big deal, this stuff. It really, really is. And seeing the power of what creativity can, can do in terms of a, a form of expression and then finding pathways post this festival for them to continue doing that. that next year and the year after the year after that it continues to kind of bed in and grow so if somebody's like thinking that they might want to try trying out a poem on a stage doing something having a go this is a this is a cool place to do it i hope i hope we, we kick off a few little sparks of inspiration <laughs>